Welcome to our mathematics class. Adding similar fraction. We have 3 fifth plus 1 fifth. In adding similar fraction, i-add lamang ang ating numerator at kopyahin ang ating denominator. Kaya, 3 plus 1 is equals to 4. Ano ulit ang ating denominator? 5. Kopyahin lang. So, 3 fifth plus 1 fifth is 4 fifth. Another example, we have 6, 9 plus 3, 9. I-add ang ating numerator at kopyahin lamang ang ating denominator. Kaya 6 plus 3 is 9. Copy the denominator, 9. Do not forget to simplify your final answer. Pag nagkataon na parehong numerator at denominator, 9 divided by 9, that is 1. Adding the similar fraction. Dahil the similar to gagawin muna natin similar by using the LCD. What is the LCD of one half and three fifth? Okay, so the LCD is ten. Let us rename first one half and three fifth. So one half multiply natin sa five. So magiging 5 tenths. Ang 3 fifth naman, rename natin ang 3 fifth. Multiply natin sa 2. Kaya naman, 3 times 2 is 6. The denominator is 2 times 5 equals to 10. Ngayon, magkapareho na 5 tenths plus 6 tenths. That is equals to 5 plus 6, 11. The denominator, dahil ito ay improper, kailangan natin siyang gawing simplify. Ilang 10 meron sa 1, that is 1. Ang remainder ay 1. Then, copy the denominator. So, the final answer is 1 and 1 tenths. Example, 3 fourth plus 2 16. Change first the fraction to similar fraction by using the LCD. What is the LCD of 3 fourth and 2 16? Okay, so that is 16. Let us rename 3 fourth. Anong pwede nyo multiply sa 4 para maging 16? Okay, so multiply natin numerator at denominator sa 4. So 3 times 4 is 12. Then, copy of 4 times 4, 16. Next, rename to 16. Anong pwedeng mag-multiply para maging 16? Okay, that is 1. So, magiging ganun pa rin. Ngayon, similar na sila. Pwede na tayong mag-add. Twelve plus two is equals to fourteen. Then copy the denominator sixteen. Do not forget to simplify your final answer. So fourteen and sixteen and ang pwede mag divide. We can divide it by two. Fourteen divided by two, seven. Sixteen divided by two, eight. Kaya ang final answer natin ay seven eight. Adding mixed fraction, we have 3 and 4 fifth plus 4 and 6 fifth. Add natin ang whole number, 3 plus 4, that is equals to 7. Add the numerator, 4 plus 6 is equals to 10. Copy the denominator, that is 10. Do not forget to simplify. 
At dahil ang ating numerator at denominator dito ay pareho, that is also equals to 1. So, 1 plus 7 is equals to 8. So, 3 and 4 fifth plus 4 and 6 fifth is equals to 8. Adding mixed fraction. We have 5 and 1 half plus 2 and 2 thirds. Dahil magkaiba ang ating denominator, hanapin muna natin ang ating LCD. What is the LCD of 1 half and 2 third? Okay, so that is 6. Rename 5 and 1 half. Para maging 6, multiply muna natin ito sa 3. Multiply the numer numerator by 3. Multiply the denominator by 3. So, 1 times 3, that is 3. 2 times 3 is 6. Then, copy whole number. Rename 2 and 2 turn. Para maging 6 ang ating denominator, multiply natin ito sa 2. Multiply numerator by 2, multiply the denominator by 2. 2 times 2 is 4. 3 times 2 is 6. Then, copy whole number. Dahil pareho na ang kanilang denominator, pwede na tayong mag-add. Add the whole number. 5 plus 2 is equals to 7. 3 plus 4 7. Then, copy denominator 6. Simplify your answer. Dahil ito ay improper, divide natin how many 6 are there in 7. We have 1. So, 7 plus 1, that is 8. Anong remainder? 1. Then, copy 6. So, 5 and 1 half plus 2 and 2 third, that is equals to 8 and 1 6. Subtracting fraction. We have 4 and 3 fourth minus 2 and 1 fourth. Atulad lang ng addition, gawin lang itong subtraction. So, subtract 4 minus 2, that is equals to 2. Subtract the numerator, 3 minus 1 is equals to 2. Copy the denominator, 4, 4. Then, do not forget to simplify your answer. So, 2 and 2 fourth is equals to 2 and 1 half. Subtracting fraction, we have 10 and 3 fifth minus 2 and 1 third. Dahil magkaiba ang ating denominator, hanapin muna ang LCD. What is the LCD of 3 fifth and 1 third? Okay, so the LCD is 15. Rename 10 and 3 fifth. Multiply the numerator and the denominator by 3. So, 3 times 3, that is 9. 5 times 3, 15, and copy the whole number, 10. Rename 2 and 1 third. Multiply the numerator and the denominator by 5. 1 times 5 is 5. 3 times 5 is 5. 15. Then, copy the whole number. Dahil pareho na ang ating fraction, pwede na tayong mag-subtract. Subtract the whole number. 10 minus 2 is equals to 8. 9 minus 5 4. Then, copy the denominator. So, 8 and 3 fifth minus 2 and 1 third 
is equals to 8 and 4, 15. Subtracting fractions, we have 9 and 1, 8, minus 3 and 5, 6. Dahil ang ating denominator ay magkaiba, hanapin muna natin ang LCD. What is the LCD of 1, 8, and 5, 6? Okay, so that is 24. Rename 9 and 1, 8. Multiply the numerator and the denominator by 3. So, 1 times 3 is equals to 3. 8 times 3, 24. Copy the whole number. Rename 3 and 5, 6. Multiply the numerator and the denominator by 4. So, 5 times 4 is equals to 20. 6 times 4 is 24. Copy the whole number, 3. So, we have 9 and 3, 24 minus 3 and 20, 24. At dahil dito, hindi natin pwedeng isubtract ang ating numerator, 3 minus 20, magbabarrow muna tayo ng isa sa 9. So, si 9 ay magiging 8 plus 1 plus 3 and 24. Dahil 24 ang ating denominator, Dapat magiging equal to 1 pa rin siya. So, change natin si 1 ng 24 over 24. Okay. So, 24 plus 3, that is 27 over 24. Then, copy the whole number 8. Okay, so ngayon pwede na tayo mag-subtract. 27 minus 20, that is equals to 7. Copy the denominator, 24. Subtract the whole number. 8 minus 3, 5. So, 9 and 1, 8 minus 3 and 5, 6, that is equals to 1 and 7 over 24.